Hi guys, welcome back to The Home and Homestead. I'm Rebecca and today we'll be doing some money saving tips where we make our own DIY Dawn Power Wash Refill. So if you've ever used the Dawn Power Wash dish spray, you'll know that it works really well for washing dishes and helping decrease and take that stuck on food residue off of your dishes. And I've been making some homemade Dawn Power Wash Refill solutions for a number of years now and I wanted to share with you guys how I do it because if you make your own you'll save some money and as with all homemade items you control the ingredients. So follow along while we do this DIY Dawn Power Wash Refill. So typically when I would make my Dawn Power Wash Refills I would just squirt a little Dawn in, add a little isopropyl alcohol and it would work just fine. But I actually took the time and experimented and figured out what ratio would ended up being that I would typically use and I will share those measurements with you guys today. So when I make the power wash refills, I use my Dawn Platinum dish detergent. And I also use some rubbing alcohol. This is a 70% isopropyl alcohol and warm water. So earlier today, I did a final check to make sure I had the ratios of what I typically use. And I did this refill here. I have an empty bottle here that we can make together. So I'll take the cap off. And the ratio that I discovered that I like is a two to one of Dawn Platinum to the rubbing alcohol. So I will do a two ounces of the Dawn dish detergent and I will do one ounce of the rubbing alcohol. So if you think more in tablespoons, you'd simply double the ounces. So two ounces would be four tablespoons. And if you think more in cups, it would be a quarter cup. One ounce would be two tablespoons or an eighth cup. So we'll put two ounces or four tablespoons or a quarter cup of the Dawn Platinum dish detergent into the Dawn Power Wash refill bottle. And I found that it goes to about the bottom of this little sticker. And then I'll add one ounce or two tablespoons or an eighth cup of a rubbing alcohol. That's a 70% isopropyl alcohol. And finally, we'll just fill the bottle with some warm water. You'll want to use a distilled or filtered bottled water for this. And that ended up being about 16 ounces or two cups of warm water. And then just put the cover on and give it a little shake or invert the bottle back and forth. Let those help to distribute the dish detergent, rubbing alcohol throughout the water to create our Dawn Power Wash Refill solution. And there you have it. Now I'll just attach this to one of the spray heads. And there you go. Nice foam has that nice fresh dawn smell. This will be great for washing dishes, tidying up around the house. This works great for cleaning your sinks and tubs. You can also use this for laundry if you have grease stains on your kitchen towels or clothing. A little spray of this on there as a pre-treatment works really well. And I also use this outside. This works great on the driveway if you have any oil drips or around the grill on your deck or patio. Just spray a little bit of your Dawn Power Wash and hose it off or just let nature do its thing with some rain. Well, I hope you enjoyed our time together while we did this money saving tip of creating some homemade Dawn Power Wash spray. This is a great DIY recipe. The Dawn Power Wash spray is really versatile. It works great in the kitchen, around the house and in the yard as well as in the laundry room. If you're interested in other money saving tips and tips and tricks, you can check out some other videos I have on homemade items that you can create that are both useful and great to give as gifts. I also have a video on how to make a homemade carpet cleaning solution concentrate that works wonderfully inside of your carpet shampooer, spot cleaner, as well as to make a pre-treatment in a spray bottle. 
Or if you're new to the channel or haven't done so yet, I would really appreciate you subscribing. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. See you next time. Take care.